Expression Media uses catalogs of thumbnails to organize your files. Catalogs do not store your original files, they only store links to your original files. Because the catalogs represent a visual record of your files, they're always available for searching even when your actual media is on another computer or on an external hard drive or data storage device or even a network volume that's not currently connected. When you launch Expression Media, you're presented with a blank catalog. In the center of the empty catalog window, it says, Drop media files, folders, or disks here, or use Import Items on the File menu to add media items to this catalog. We'll be covering all the ways you can import folders and files into Expression Media in the next video. For now, drag a folder of media from your hard drive into the blank Expression Media catalog. In this case, I have a folder full of JPEGs, TIFFs, and Photoshop files, and you'll see how the catalog fills up with your media. As the central document that Expression Media creates is a catalog, you'll want to choose File, Save As, and save your catalog in a place on your hard drive where you'll store all of your Expression Media catalogs, or within the project folder for a particular client job or project if the catalog will be associated with that project. You'll notice the .ivc file extension on the catalogs you save, and you should always keep that file extension intact when naming your files. .ivc is a holdover from the old name of the Expression Media application, which was iView, and the C in IVC stands for Catalog. Go back to the File menu and choose Catalog Info and add some pertinent text to describe this catalog. If you'd like to password protect this catalog, click Set Password and enter your password in the text field. Anyone opening this catalog will have to enter this password to gain access. You can remove the password requirement from any catalog by accessing the catalog and then opening Catalog Info and clearing the password field. Click OK to save your password changes and then click OK to save the catalog info. Remember to choose File Save to save all of your changes. As you've undoubtedly experienced over the past several years, accumulation of digital files in a variety of different file formats is consistently on the rise in the workplace, and it's essential to be able to easily track these files for quick browsing, retrieval, editing, and use in projects, as well as for the purpose of creating backups and archives. Most businesses accumulate thousands of Word, Excel, PowerPoint, and email files over the course of a single year, Office 2008 for Mac Special Media Edition with Expression Media can help you consolidate, manage, track, and prioritize all of your files and helps you track and locate these files much more efficiently. Expression Media 2 has an extensive set of powerful features to help you take control of all of your digital assets and is compatible with over 100 unique digital media file formats, including camera raw image formats and provides you with precise editing and image correction tools that enable you to accurately refine your images. The application also comes with an extensive set of industry standard metadata fields that enable you to dictate and refine how you categorize and find large quantities of files into a method that works seamlessly for your business. This annotation process, which we'll cover in detail in a later video, can also be automated with batch processing. Expression Media's keywording functions provide seamless integration with other high-end media editing tools such as Adobe Photoshop and allows you to create catalogs of images from digital cameras, CDs, and DVDs, and even directly from the Internet. Once you've created your catalogs, you can easily publish your images online, burn them to CD or DVD-ROM, or create high-quality contact sheets and printouts. You can convert and re-export photo, movie, and sound files right from within Expression Media, and you can design and customize high-quality slideshow presentations and view them on your computer display, export them as full-motion movie files, or send groups of files to a colleague via email directly from a catalog. In Part 4 of this series, we'll get into the basics of Expression Media and the core functionality of creating multiple catalogs and importing your files.